morning, Whalers, and welcome to the WCPS News Network. My name is Olivia Sabin. And I'm Ashley Clapp. Today is Monday, December 20th, and it's day two. Today we are being brought to you by Island Variety at 59 Old South Road, who has what you need for that birthday celebration, holiday get-together, or your last-minute Christmas gift. They have a great selection of puzzles, board games, Lego, Barbie, and craft kits. And don't forget the Kodak kiosk for present printing your photos and preserving those memories. Let's send a huge happy birthday shout out to Zavi Ritas Rondon. Happy birthday, Zavi. For lunch, we'll be dining on a classic American cheeseburger. Our weather will see early clouds that give way to partial sun sunshine later with high temperatures in the upper 30s. In sports on Saturday, the boys varsity basketball team crushed Tri-Country. 71 to 29 and JV basketball team beat Tri-Country 55 to 26. On Saturday night the Patriots lost a tough game to the Colts with a final score of 27 to 17. The Bills beat the Panthers 31 to 14 which means they are only one game behind the Pats in the AFC East standing. These two teams will play each other in this Sunday in Foxborough. In case you didn't know, Nantucket is experiencing a surge in COVID cases unlike any seen for months. Late Friday, the town reported 112 new cases identified on the island from Thursday, December 9th through December, th December 16th. The island's testing positivity rate rose to over 13% with two COVID-related hospitalizations at the Nantucket Cottage Hospital. The majority of the cases are, are the Delta variant, which first arrived this past summer, but now the presence of the Omicron variant will likely drive case numbers even higher ahead of the holidays. We must know, we must, yeah, we must now remember the basics of exposure management like wearing ma mask wearing in public, indoor spaces, and the importance of vaccination. <laughs> a 31-year-old man riding an e-bike was seriously injured last week when he hit a deer while riding on Old South Road bike path. According to Nantucket Current, based on the evidence at the scene, the rider was traveling at 47 miles per hour, the maximum speed for the bike. The accident occurred shortly after sunset near 33 Old South Road when a deer ran out in front of the cyclist. The extent of the man's injuries are not known, but it's unclear if he will face any charges related to the accident. This is a reminder to all students who ride an e-bike or regular bikes, please be careful and wear a helmet. Well, you better tune up your voice today because it is National Go Caroling Day which, of course, caroling is the practice of singing Christmas songs from door to door as a form of celebration. The word carol means a joyful song or dance. The tradition of singing carols has roots from the pagan celebrations of the winter solstice. Carols were later adopted by the Christian faith to celebrate the nativity during the 4th and 5th centuries. So, on Go Caroling Day, gather your best voices and sing your favorite Christmas songs door to door in your neighborhood. Okay, that's all the news for today. Please remember to wear your masks while in school and follow all of our COVID-19 protocols. Also, don't forget, Santa is always watching you. Have a great weekend, take care of yourselves and each other, and most importantly, be, be kind, kind to one, one another. another! Bye! Have a great day! Bye.